In numerical analysis, a branch of mathematics, there are several square root algorithms or methods of computing the principal square root of a non-negative real number. For the square roots of a negative or complex number, see below. Finding s display style s is the same as solving the equation f x equals x two minus s equals zero display style f x equals x caret two s equals zero for a positive x display style x Therefore, any general numerical root finding algorithm can be used. Newton's method, for example, reduces in this case to the so called Babylonian method x n plus 1 equals x n minus f x n f x n equals x n minus x n 2 minus s 2 x n equals 1 2 x n plus s x n Display style x underscore n plus one equals x underscore n frac f x underscore n f x underscore n equals x underscore n frac x underscore n carrot two s two x underscore n equals frac one two left x underscore n plus frac s x underscore and right. These methods generally yield approximate results, but can be made arbitrarily precise by increasing the number of calculation steps. Topic rough estimation Many square root algorithms require an initial seed value. If the initial seed value is far away from the actual square root, the algorithm will be slowed down. It is therefore useful to have a rough estimate, which may be very inaccurate but easy to calculate. With s, display style s, expressed in scientific notation as a times 10 to n, display style a times 10 caret 2 n, where 1 a 100, display style 1 leq a and n as an integer, the square root s equals a times 10 n, display style sqrt s equals sqrt a times 10 caret n can be estimated as s approximately equals. 2 10 n if a 10 6 10 n if a 10 display style sqrt s approximately begin cases 2 c d o t 10 caret n and text if a end cases the factors 2 and 6 are used because they approximate the geometric means of the lowest and highest possible values with the given number of digits 1 10 equals 10 4 approximately equals 2 display style sqrt sqrt 1 c d o t sqrt 10 equals sqrt 4 10 approximately 2 and 10 one hundred equals one thousand four 
approximately equals 6 display style sqrt sqrt 10 cdot sqrt 100 equals sqrt 4 1000 approximately 6 4 s equals 125348 equals 12.5348 times 104 display style s equals 125348 equals 12.5348 times 10 caret 4 the estimate as s approximately equals 6102 equals 600 display style sqrt s approximately 6 CDOT 10 carat 2 equals 600. When working in the binary numeral system, as computers do internally, by expressing s display style s as a times 2 2 n display style a times 2 carat 2 n, where 0.1 2 a 10 2 display style 0.1 underscore 2 leq a, the square root s equals a times 2 n display style sqrt s equals sqrt a times 2 carat n can be estimated as s approximately equals 2 n display style sqrt s approximately 2 carat n since the geometric mean of the lowest and highest possible values is 0 1 2 10 2 equals 1 4 equals 1 display style sqrt sqrt 0.1 underscore 2 cdot sqrt 10 underscore 2 equals sqrt 4 1 equals 1 4 s equals 125348 equals 1 11 10 1001 10 10 0100 2 equals 1.1110 1001 10 10 O one O O two times two sixteen Display style S equals one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight equals one eleven ten one thousand one ten ten O one O O underscore two equals one point one 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 zero one thousand one ten ten O one O O underscore two times two carat sixteen The binary approximation gives S approximately equals 2 8 equals 1 o o o o o o o o 2 equals 256 Display style sqrt s approximately two carat eight equals one o o o o o o o o underscore two equals two hundred fifty six. These approximations are useful to find better seeds for iterative algorithms, which results in faster convergence. Topic. Babylonian method Perhaps the first algorithm used for approximating S display style sqrt s is known as the Babylonian method despite there being no direct evidence beyond informed conjecture that the eponymous Babylonian mathematicians employed exactly this method 
The method is also known as Heron's method, after the first-century Greek mathematician Hero of Alexandria who gave the first explicit description of the method in his AD 60 work Metrica. It can be derived from but predates by 16 centuries Newton's method. The basic idea is that if x is an overestimate to the square root of a non-negative real number s then s, x will be an underestimate, or vice versa, and so the average of these two numbers may reasonably be expected to provide a better approximation, though the formal proof of that assertion depends on the inequality of arithmetic and geometric means that shows this average is always an overestimate of the square root, as noted in the article on square root thus assuring convergence. More precisely, if x is our initial guess of s and e is the error in our estimate such that s equals x plus e 2, then we can expand the binomial and solve for e equals s minus x 2 2 x plus e approximately equals s minus x 2 2 x Display style e equals frac s x caret two two x plus e approximately frac s x caret two two x. Since e x display style e l l x. Therefore, we can compensate for the error and update our old estimate as x plus e approximately equals x plus s minus x 2 2 x equals s plus x 2 2 x equals s x plus x 2 x revised Display style x plus e approximately x plus frac s x caret two two x equals frac s plus x caret two two x equals frac frac s x plus x two equiv x underscore text revised. Since the computed error was not exact, this becomes our next best guess. The process of updating is iterated until desired accuracy is obtained. This is a quadratically convergent algorithm, which means that the number of correct digits of the approximation roughly doubles with each iteration. It proceeds as follows. Begin with an arbitrary positive starting value x0 the closer to the actual square root of s, the better. Let xn plus 1 be the average of xn and s, xn using the arithmetic mean to approximate the geometric mean. Repeat step 2 until the desired accuracy is achieved. It can also be represented as x 0 approximately equals s Display style x underscore zero approximately sqrt s x n plus one equals one two x n plus s x n 
Display style x underscore n plus one equals frac one two left x underscore n plus frac s x underscore n right s equals lim n infinity x n Display style sqrt s equals lim underscore n to in a t x underscore n. This algorithm works equally well in the p-adic numbers, but cannot be used to identify real square roots with p-adic square roots. One can, for example, construct a sequence of rational numbers by this method that converges to plus three in the reals, but to minus three in the two adics. Topic. Example To calculate square root s, where s equals 125,348, to six significant figures, use the rough estimation method above to get x 0 equals 6 10 2 equals 600.000 x 1 equals 1 2 x 0 plus s x 0 equals 1 Two six hundred point zero 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 plus one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight six hundred O O O equals four hundred four point four five seven X two equals one Two x one plus s x one equals one two four hundred four point four five seven plus one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight. Four hundred four point four five seven equals three hundred fifty seven one hundred eighty seven x three equals one two x two plus s x Two equals one two three hundred fifty seven point one eight seven plus one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight three hundred fifty seven point one eight seven equals three hundred fifty four O five nine x 4 equals 1 2 x 3 plus s x 3 equals 1 2 354.059 Plus one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight three hundred fifty four point zero five nine equals three hundred fifty four 
O four five x five equals one two x four plus S x four equals one two three hundred fifty four point zero four five plus one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight three hundred fifty four point zero four five equals three hundred fifty four point zero four five display style begin aligned begin array R L L L x underscore zero and equals six C D O T ten carrot two and an equals six hundred point zero 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 point three M x underscore one and equals F R A C one two left x underscore zero plus F R A C S x underscore zero right and equals F R A C one two left six hundred point zero 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 plus F R A C one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight six hundred point zero 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 right and equals four hundred four point four five seven zero point three M x underscore two and equals FRAC one two left x underscore one plus FRAC S x underscore one right and equals FRAC one two left four hundred four Four point four five seven plus FRAC one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight four hundred four point four five seven right and equals three hundred fifty seven point one eight seven zero point three M X underscore three and equals FRAC one two left X underscore two plus FRAC S X underscore two right and equals FRAC one two left three hundred fifty seven point one eight seven plus FRAC one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight three hundred fifty seven point one eight seven right and equals three hundred fifty four point zero five nine zero point three M X underscore four and equals FRAC one two left X underscore three plus FRAC R A C S X underscore three right and equals F R A C one two left three hundred fifty four point zero five nine plus F R A C one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight three hundred fifty four point zero five nine right and equals three hundred fifty four point zero four five zero point three M X underscore five and equals F R A C C one two left x underscore four plus frac s x underscore four right and equals frac one two left three hundred fifty four point zero four five plus frac one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight three hundred fifty four point zero four five right and equals three hundred fifty four point zero four five end array a end aligned therefore square root 125348 approximately equals 354.045 topic convergence suppose that x0 greater than 0 and s greater than 0 then for any natural number n, x n greater than zero. Let the relative error in x n be defined by epsilon n equals x n s minus one greater than minus one. Display style var epsilon underscore n equals frac x underscore n sqrt s minus one greater than minus one, and thus x n equals s one plus epsilon n. 
Display style x underscore n equals sqrt s c d o t one plus var epsilon underscore n. Then it can be shown that epsilon n plus one equals epsilon n two two. One plus epsilon n zero display style var epsilon underscore n plus one equals frac var epsilon underscore n caret two two one plus var epsilon underscore n geq zero and thus that epsilon N plus two min epsilon N plus one two two epsilon N plus one two Display style var epsilon underscore n plus two l e q min left frac var epsilon underscore n plus one caret two two frac var epsilon underscore n plus one two right, and consequently that convergence is assured and quadratic. Topic worst case for convergence If using the rough estimate above with the Babylonian method, then the least accurate cases in ascending order are as follows, s equals 1, x0 equals 2, x1 equals 1.250, epsilon 1 equals 0 0.250, s equals 10, x0 equals 2, x1 equals 3.500, epsilon 1 0. 0.107. S equals 10, x0 equals 6, x1 equals 3.833, epsilon 10.213, S equals 100, x0 equals 6, x1 equals 11.333, epsilon 10.134. Display style begin aligned s and equals one and x underscore zero and equals two and x underscore one and equals one point two five zero and var epsilon underscore one and equals zero point two five zero s and equals ten and x underscore zero and equals two and x underscore one and equals three point five zero zero and var epsilon underscore one and three hundred thirty three and var epsilon underscore one and thus in any case epsilon one two minus two display style var epsilon underscore one l e q two caret minus two epsilon two two minus five ten minus one display style var epsilon underscore two epsilon three two minus eleven ten minus three Display style var epsilon underscore three epsilon four two minus twenty three ten minus six display style var epsilon underscore four epsilon five two minus forty seven ten minus fourteen display style var epsilon underscore five epsilon six two minus ninety five ten minus twenty eight display style var epsilon underscore six epsilon seven two minus one hundred ninety one ten minus fifty seven display style var epsilon underscore seven epsilon eight two minus three hundred eighty three ten minus one hundred fifteen display style var epsilon underscore eight Rounding errors will slow the convergence. It is recommended to keep at least one extra digit beyond the desired accuracy of the xn being calculated to minimize round-off error. Topic: <laughs> Bakshali method. 
This method for finding an approximation to a square root was described in an ancient Indian mathematical manuscript called the Bakshali manuscript. It is equivalent to two iterations of the Babylonian method beginning with x0. Thus, the algorithm is cortically convergent, which means that the number of correct digits of the approximation roughly quadruples with each iteration. The original presentation, using modern notation, is as follows, to calculate s s let x02 be the initial approximation to s then, successively iterate as a n equals s minus x n 2 2 x n Display style underscore n equals frac s x underscore n caret two two x underscore n b n equals x n plus a n Display style b underscore n equals x underscore n plus a underscore n x n plus one equals b n minus a n two two B N Display style x underscore N plus one equals B underscore N FRAC a underscore N carrot two two B underscore N Written explicitly, it becomes X N plus one equals X N plus A N minus A N two two X N plus A N Display style x underscore n plus one equals x underscore n plus a underscore n frac a underscore n carrot two two x underscore n plus a underscore n. Let x zero equals n be an integer which is the nearest perfect square to s. Also, let the difference d equals s, n2, then the first iteration can be written as s approximately equals n plus d 2 n minus d 2 8 n Three plus four N D equals eight N four plus eight N two D plus D two Eight N three plus four N D equals N four plus six N two S plus S two four N 
3 plus 4 n s equals n 2 n 2 plus 6 s plus s 2 4 n n 2 plus s Display style S Q R T S approximately N plus F R A C D two N F R A C D carrot two eight N carrot three plus four N D equals F R A C eight N carrot four plus eight N carrot two D plus D carrot two eight N carrot three plus four N D equals F R A C N carrot four plus six n carrot two s plus s carrot two four n carrot three plus four n s equals frac n carrot two n carrot two plus six s plus s carrot two four n n carrot two plus s. This gives a rational approximation to the square root. Topic. Example Using the same example as given in Babylonian method, let S equals 125,348 Display style S equals 125,348 Then, the first iterations gives x 0 equals 600 display style x underscore 0 equals 600 a 1 equals 125348 minus 600 2 2 times 600 equals minus 195.543 display style underscore 1 equals frac 125348 600 caret 2 2 times 600 equals minus 195.543 B one equals six hundred plus minus one hundred ninety five point five four three equals four hundred four point four five six Display style b underscore one equals six hundred plus minus one hundred ninety five point five four three equals four hundred four point four five six x one equals four hundred four point four five six minus minus 195.543 2 2 times 404.456 equals 357 186 Display style x underscore one equals four hundred four point four five six FRAC minus one hundred ninety five point five four three carrot two two times four hundred four point four five six equals three hundred fifty seven point one eight six. Likewise, the second iteration gives a two equals one hundred twenty five thousand three hundred forty eight minus 
357.186 2 2 times 357.186 equals minus 3.126 display style a underscore 2 equals frac 125348 minus 357.186 2 2 times 357.186 equals minus 3.126 b 2 equals 357.186 plus minus 3.126 equals 354.06 display style b underscore 2 equals 357.186 plus minus 3.126 equals 354.06 x 2 equals 354.06 minus minus 3.1269 2 2 times 354.06 equals 354.046 display style x underscore 2 equals 354.06 frac minus 3.1269 caret 2 2 times 354.06 equals 354 O four six Topic Digit by digit calculation This is a method to find each digit of the square root in a sequence. It is slower than the Babylonian method, but it has several advantages. It can be easier for manual calculations. Every digit of the root found is known to be correct, i.e., it does not have to be changed later. If the square root has an expansion that terminates, the algorithm terminates after the last digit is found. Thus, it can be used to check whether a given integer is a square number. The algorithm works for any base, and naturally, the way it proceeds depends on the base chosen. Napier's bones include an aid for the execution of this algorithm. The shifting nth root algorithm is a generalization of this method. Topic: <laughs> Basic principle. First, let's consider the simplest possible case of finding the square root of a number z, that is the square of a two-digit number x y, where x is the tens digit and y is the units digit. Specifically, z topic 10x plus y 2 100x2 plus 20xy plus y2 Now using the digit by digit algorithm, we first determine the value of xx as the largest digit such that x2 is less or equal to z from which we removed the two rightmost digits. In the next iteration, we pair the digits, multiply x by 2, and place it in the tenths place while we try to figure out what the value of y is. Since this is a simple case where the answer is a perfect square root x y, the algorithm stops here. The same idea can be extended to any arbitrary square root computation next. Suppose we are able to find the square root of n by expressing it as a sum of n positive numbers such that n equals 
a one plus a two plus a three plus plus a n two Display style n equals a underscore one plus a underscore two plus a underscore three plus d o t s b plus a underscore n caret two. By repeatedly applying the basic identity x plus y two equals x. Two plus two x y plus y two display style x plus y caret two equals x caret two plus two x y plus y caret two. The right hand side term can be expanded as a. One plus a two plus a three plus plus a n two equals a one two plus two a one a two plus a two two plus two a one plus a two a three plus a three two plus plus a n minus one two plus two i equals one n minus one A I A N plus A N two equals A one two plus two A one plus a two a two plus two a one plus a two plus a three a three plus plus two I equals one N minus one A I plus A N A N Display style begin aligned and a underscore one plus a underscore two plus a underscore three plus d o t s b plus a underscore n carrot two equals an a underscore one carrot two plus two a underscore one a underscore two plus a underscore two carrot two plus two a underscore one plus a underscore two a underscore 
underscore three plus a underscore three carrot two plus D O T S B plus A underscore N one carrot two plus two left sum underscore I equals one carrot N one a underscore I right a underscore N plus A underscore N carrot two equals an a underscore one carrot two plus two A underscore one plus A underscore two a underscore two plus two a underscore one plus A underscore two plus A underscore three a underscore three plus D O T S B plus left two left sum underscore I equals one carrot N one a underscore I right plus A underscore N right a underscore N end aligned this expression allows us to find the square root by sequentially guessing the values of ai display style underscore i s suppose that the numbers a1 am minus 1 display style underscore 1 l dots a underscore m1 have already been guessed then the mth term of the right hand side of above summation is given by ym equals 2 pm minus 1 plus am am Display style y underscore m equals two p underscore m one plus a underscore m a underscore m, where p m minus one equals i equals one meter minus one a i. Display style p underscore m one equals sum underscore i equals one caret m one a underscore i is the approximate square root found so far. Now each new guess a m display style underscore m should satisfy the recursion x m equals x m minus one minus y m Display style x underscore m equals x underscore m one y underscore m such that x m zero display style x underscore m g e q zero for all one m n Display style one L E Q M L E Q N with initialization X zero equals N Display style X underscore zero equals N when X N equals zero Display style x underscore n equals zero. The exact square root has been found. If not, then the sum of a i display style underscore i s gives a suitable approximation of the square root with x n display style x underscore n being the approximation error. For example, in the decimal number system we have n equals a 1 10 n minus 1 plus a 2 10 n minus 2 plus plus a n minus 1 10 plus a n 2 
Display style n equals a underscore one c d o t ten carrot n one plus a underscore two c d o t ten carrot n two plus c d o t s plus a underscore n one c d o t ten plus a underscore n carrot two, where ten n minus i Display style ten carat n i are placeholders and the coefficients a i element of zero one two nine display style underscore i in zero one two l dots nine at any m theatrical stage of the square root calculation, the approximate root found so far p m minus one display style p underscore m one and the summation term y m display style y underscore m are given by P M minus one equals I equals one M minus one A I ten N minus I equals 10 n minus m plus 1 i equals 1 m minus 1 a i 10 m minus i minus 1 Display style p underscore m one equals sum underscore i equals one carrot m one a underscore i c d o t ten carrot n i equals ten carrot n m plus one sum underscore i equals one carrot m one a underscore i c d o t ten carrot m i one y m equals Two P M minus one plus A M ten N minus M A M ten N minus M equals 20 i equals 1 m minus 1 a i 10 m minus i minus 1 plus a M A M ten two N minus M Display style y underscore m equals two p underscore m one plus a underscore m c d o t ten carrot n m a underscore m c d o t ten carrot n m equals twenty sum underscore i equals one carrot m one a underscore i c d o t ten carrot m i one plus a underscore m a underscore m c d o t ten carat two NM Here since the place value of 
y m display style y underscore m is an even power of 10 we only need to work with the pair of most significant digits of the remaining term x m minus 1 display style x underscore m1 at any m theatrical stage the section below codifies this procedure it is obvious that a similar method can be used to compute the square root in number systems other than the decimal number system for instance finding the digit by digit square root in the binary number system is quite efficient since the value of a I display style underscore I is searched from a smaller set of binary digits 0 1 this makes the computation faster since at each stage the value of y M display style y underscore M is either y M equals zero displaystyle y underscore m equals zero for a m equals zero displaystyle underscore m equals zero or y m equals two P M minus one plus one display style y underscore m equals two p underscore m one plus one for a m equals one display style underscore M equals 1 the fact that we have only two possible options for a M display style underscore M also makes the process of deciding the value of a M display style underscore M at M theatrical stage of calculation easier. This is because we only need to check if Y M X M minus one Display style Y underscore M L E Q X underscore M one for A M equals 1 display style underscore M equals 1 if this condition is satisfied then we take a M equals 1 display style underscore M equals 1 if not then a M equals 0 display style underscore M equals 0 also the fact that multiplication by 2 is done by left bit shifts helps in the computation topic decimal base 10 Write the original number in decimal form. The numbers are written similar to the long division algorithm, and, as in long division, the root will be written on the line above. Now separate the digits into pairs, starting from the decimal point and going both left and right. The decimal point of the root will be above the decimal point of the square. One digit of the root will appear above each pair of digits of the square. Beginning with the leftmost pair of digits, do the following procedure for each pair. 
starting on the left, bring down the most significant leftmost pair of digits not yet used if all the digits have been used, write o o and write them to the right of the remainder from the previous step on the first step, there will be no remainder. In other words, multiply the remainder by 100 and add the two digits. This will be the current value C. Find P, Y and X, as follows. Let P be the part of the root found so far, ignoring any decimal point, for the first step, P equals 0. Determine the greatest digit X such that X 20 P plus X C display style x 20p plus x leq c we will use a new variable y equals x 20p plus x note 20p plus x is simply twice p with the digit x appended to the right note you can find x by guessing what c 20p is and doing a trial calculation of y then adjusting x upward or downward as necessary place the digit x display style x as the next digit of the root ie above the two digits of the square you just brought down Thus the next p will be the old p times 10 plus x. Subtract y from c to form a new remainder. If the remainder is 0 and there are no more digits to bring down, then the algorithm has terminated. Otherwise go back to step 1 for another iteration. Topic. Examples. Find the square root of 152.2756 1 2 3 4 0 1 5 2 2 7 5 6 0 1 1 asterisk 1 Topic 1 1 0 1 y Topic x asterisk x one asterisk one equals one o o five two 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 asterisk two Topic five two two o o four four y. Topic twenty plus x asterisk x twenty two asterisk two equals four four o eight two seven two four three asterisk three. Topic eight two seven three o seven two nine y. Topic two hundred forty plus x asterisk x two hundred forty three asterisk three equals seven two nine nine eight five six two four six four asterisk four. Topic nine eight five six four nine eight five six y. Topic Two thousand four hundred sixty plus x asterisk x two thousand four hundred sixty four asterisk four equals nine thousand eight hundred fifty six O O O O algorithm terminates answer is twelve point three four Find the square root of two one four one four two O two O O O O O O O O O two one asterisk one Topic two one O one Y Topic x asterisk x one asterisk one equals one O one O O two four asterisk four Topic one hundred four O O nine six Y Topic twenty plus x asterisk x twenty four asterisk four equals nine six o four o o two eight one asterisk one. Topic four hundred one o two eight one y. Topic two hundred eighty plus x asterisk x two hundred eighty one asterisk one equals two eight one o one one nine o o two eight two four asterisk four. 
Topic 119004011296Y Topic 2820 plus X asterisk X 2824 asterisk 4 equals 1129606040028282 asterisk 2 Topic 60402 The desired precision is achieved, the square root of 2 is about 1. 4142. Topic. Binary numeral system, base 2 Inherent to digit by digit algorithms is a search and test step. Find a digit e display style e when added to the right of a current solution r display style r such that r plus e r plus e x Display style R plus E C D O T R plus E L E Q X where X Display style X is the value for which a root is desired. Expanding R R plus two R E plus e e x display style r c d o t r plus 2 re plus e c d o t e l e q x the current value of r r display style r c d o t r or usually the remainder can be incrementally updated efficiently when working in binary as the value of e display style e will have a single bit set a power of 2 and the operations needed to compute 2 r e display style 2 c d o t r c d o t e and E E display style E C D O T E can be replaced with faster bit shift operations. Topic example. Here we obtain the square root of eighty one, which when converted into binary gives one million ten thousand one. The numbers in the left column gives the option between that number or zero to be used for subtraction at that stage of computation. The final answer is 1001, which in decimal is 9. 1001 Square root 1,010,001 1 1 1 1 0 one oh oh one one hundred zero one oh 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 one one oh 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 one ten thousand one zero This gives rise to simple computer implementations using the notation above the variable bit corresponds to E M two Display style e underscore m caret two, which is two m two equals four m. Display style two caret m caret two equals four caret m. The variable res is equal to two. R E M 
display style two re underscore m, and the variable num is equal to the current x m display style x underscore m which is the difference of the number we want the square root of and the square of our current approximation with all bits set up to 2 m plus 1 display style 2 caret m plus 1 thus in the first loop we want to find the highest power of 4 in bit to find the highest power of 2 in e display style e in the second loop if num is greater than res plus bit then xm display style x underscore m is greater than 2 rem plus em2 display style 2 re underscore m plus e underscore m caret 2 and we can subtract it the next line, we want to add em display style e underscore m to r display style r, which means we want to add two em two display style two e underscore m caret two to two rem display style two re underscore m. So we want res equals res plus bit em display style e underscore m to em minus one display style e underscore m one inside res which involves dividing by 2 or another shift to the right. Combining these two into one line leads to res equals res greater than greater than 1 plus bit. If x m isn't greater than 2 r e M plus E M two Display style two re underscore M plus E underscore M carrot two. Then we just update E M Display style E underscore M two E M minus 1 display style e underscore m1 inside res and divide it by 2 then we update e m display style e underscore m 2 e m minus 1 Display style e underscore m1 in bit by dividing it by four. The final iteration of the second loop has bit equal to one and will cause update of e display style e to run one extra time, removing the factor of two from res, making it our integer approximation of the root. Faster algorithms, in binary and decimal or any other base, can be realized by using lookup tables, in effect trading more storage space for reduced runtime. <laughs> Exponential identity Pocket calculators typically implement good routines to compute the exponential function and the natural logarithm, and then compute the square root of s using the identity found using the properties of logarithms. Lane x north equals n lane x Display style lane x caret north equals n lane x and exponentials e lane x equals x display style east caret lane x equals x s equals east one 
2 plane s Display style S Q R T S equals E carrot F R A C one two plane S. The denominator in the fraction corresponds to the nth root. In the case above the denominator is two, hence the equation specifies that the square root is to be found. The same identity is used when computing square roots with logarithm tables or slide rules. Topic. Vedic duplex method for extracting a square root The Vedic duplex method from the book Vedic Mathematics is a variant of the digit-by-digit -digit method for calculating the square root. The duplex is the square of the central digit plus double the cross product of digits equidistant from the center. The duplex is computed from the quotient digits, square root digits, computed thus far, but after the initial digits. The duplex is subtracted from the dividend digit prior to the second subtraction for the product of the quotient digit times the divisor digit. For perfect squares, the duplex and the dividend will get smaller and reach zero after a few steps. For non-perfect squares the decimal value of the square root can be calculated to any precision desired. However, as the decimal places proliferate, the duplex adjustment gets larger and longer to calculate. The duplex method follows the Vedic ideal for an algorithm, one line, mental calculation. It is flexible in choosing the first digit group and the divisor. Small divisors are to be avoided by starting with a larger initial group. Topic: <inaudible> Basic principle. We proceed as with the digit by digit calculation by assuming that we want to express a number n as a square of the sum of n positive numbers as n equals a zero plus a one plus plus a n minus one two Display style n equals a underscore zero plus a underscore one plus c d o t s plus a underscore n one carrot two equals a zero two plus two a zero i equals one N minus one A I plus O one two plus two A one I equals two N Minus one A I plus plus A N minus one two Display style equals a underscore zero carrot two plus two a underscore zero sum underscore i equals one carrot n one a underscore i plus a underscore one carrot two plus two a underscore one sum underscore i equals two carrot n one a underscore i plus c d o t s plus a underscore n one carrot two Define divisor as Q equals two a zero display style Q equals two a underscore zero 
and the duplex for a sequence of m numbers as d m equals a m 2 2 plus i equals 1 m 2 2 a i a m minus i plus 1 4 m odd i equals 1 m 2 2 a i a m minus i plus one for m even display style d underscore m equals begin cases a underscore l c e i l m two r seal carrot two plus sum underscore i equals one carrot l floor m two r floor two a underscore i a underscore m i plus one and text four m text odd sum underscore I equals one carrot m two two a underscore i a underscore m i plus one and text for m text even end cases. Thus, we can re-express the above identity in terms of the divisor and the duplexes as n minus o two equals i equals one n minus one q a i plus d i display style n a underscore zero carrot two equals sum underscore i equals 1 caret n1 q a underscore i plus d underscore i now the computation can proceed by recursively guessing the values of a m display style underscore m so that x m equals x M minus one minus Q A M minus D M Display style x underscore m equals x underscore m one Q A underscore M D underscore M such that x m 0 display style x underscore m geq 0 for all 1 m n minus 1 display style 1 leq m leq n 1 with initialization x zero equals N minus a zero two Displaystyle x underscore zero equals N A underscore zero carrot two when x M equals zero Display style x underscore m equals zero. The algorithm terminates and the sum of a i display style underscore i s give the square root. The method is more similar to long division, where x m minus one display style x underscore m1 is the dividend and x m display style x underscore m is the remainder for the case of decimal numbers if n equals a 0 10 n Minus 
one plus a one ten N minus two plus plus A N minus two ten plus A N minus one two Display style n equals a underscore zero c d o t ten carrot n one plus a underscore one c d o t ten carrot n two plus c d o t s plus a underscore n two c d o t ten plus a underscore n one carrot two, where a i element of Zero, one, two, nine. Display style a underscore i in zero one two l dots nine. Then the initiation x zero equals n minus a zero. Two ten two N minus one Display style x underscore zero equals N A underscore zero carrot two C D O T ten carrot two N one and the divisor will be Q equals Two a zero ten N minus one Display style Q equals two A underscore zero C D O T ten carat N one. Also the product at any M theatrical stage will be Q A M Ten N minus M minus one equals two a zero A M ten two N minus M Minus two Display style Q A underscore M C D O T ten carat N M one equals two A underscore zero A underscore M C D O T ten carat two N M two and the duplexes will be D M equals D tilde M ten two N minus M minus three Display style D underscore M equals tilde D underscore M C D O T ten carat two N M three where D tilde M display style tilde d underscore m are the duplexes of the sequence a one a two a m display style a underscore one a underscore two l dots a underscore m at any m theatrical stage, we see that the place value of the duplex d tilde m display style tilde d underscore m is one less than the product two a zero a 
M Display style two A underscore zero A underscore M Thus, in actual calculations it is customary to subtract the duplex value of the M theatrical stage at M plus one theatrical stage. Also, unlike the previous digit-by-digit digit square root calculation, where at any given M theatrical stage, the calculation is done by taking the most significant pair of digits of the remaining term x m minus 1 x underscore m1 the duplex method uses only a single most significant digit of x m minus 1 display style x underscore m1 in other words to calculate the duplex of a number double the product of each pair of equidistant digits plus the square of the center digit of the digits to the right of the colon in a square root calculation the quotient digit set increases incrementally for each step. Example Consider the perfect square 2809 equals 532. Use the duplex method to find the square root of 2809. Set down the number in groups of two digits. Define a divisor, a dividend and a quotient to find the root. Given 2809. Consider the first group, 28. Find the nearest perfect square below that group. The root of that perfect square is the first digit of our root. Since 28 greater than 25 and 25 equals 52, take 5 as the first digit in the square root. For the divisor take double this first digit 2 5, which is 10. Next, set up a division framework with a colon. 28 to 09 is the dividend and 5, is the quotient. Note, the quotient should always be a single digit number, and it should be such that the dividend in the next stage is non-negative. Put a colon to the right of 28 and 5 and keep the colons lined up vertically. The duplex is calculated only on quotient digits to the right of the colon. Calculate the remainder. 28, minus 25, is 3. Append the remainder on the left of the next digit to get the new dividend. Here, append 3 to the next dividend digit 0, which makes the new dividend 30. The divisor 10 goes into 30 just 3 times, no reserve needed here for subsequent deductions. Repeat the operation. The zero remainder appended to 9. 9 is the next dividend. This provides a digit to the right of the colon so deduct the duplex, 32 equals 9. Subtracting this duplex from the dividend 9, a zero remainder results. 10 into 0 is 0. The next root digit is 0. The next duplex is 2 3 0 equals 0. The dividend is 0. This is an exact square root, 53. Find the square root of 2809. Set down the number in groups of two digits. The number of groups gives the number of whole digits in the root. Put a colon after the first group, 28, to separate it. From the first group, 28, obtain the divisor, 10, since 28 greater than 25 equals 52 and by doubling this first root, 2 times 5 equals 10. Gross dividend, 28 to 09. Using mental math. Divisor, 10, 30 square, 10, 28 to 39. 
duplex, deduction, 25, xx09 square root, 5 to 3, 0, dividend, 30 00, remainder, 3 o'clock 00, square root, quotient, 5 to 3, 0, Topic A2 variable iterative method This method is applicable for finding the square root of 0 S3 display style 0 and converges best for S approximately equals 1 display style S approximately 1. This, however, is no real limitation for a computer-based calculation, as in base 2 floating point and fixed point representations, it is trivial to multiply s, display style s, by an integer power of 4, and therefore s, display style sqrt s by the corresponding power of 2, by changing the exponent or by shifting, respectively. Therefore, s display style s can be moved to the range 1 2 s 2 display style frac 1 2 leq s. Moreover, the following method does not employ general divisions, but only additions, subtractions, multiplications, and divisions by powers of 2, which are again trivial to implement. A disadvantage of the method is that numerical errors accumulate, in contrast to single variable iterative methods such as the Babylonian one. The initialization step of this method is a 0 equals s display style underscore 0 equals s c 0 equals s minus 1 display style c underscore 0 equals s 1 while the iterative steps read a n plus 1 equals a n minus a n c n 2 display style underscore n plus 1 equals a underscore n a underscore n c underscore n 2 c n plus 1 equals C N two C N minus three four display style C underscore N plus one equals C underscore N carrot two C underscore N minus three four then A N S display style underscore n right arrow s q r t s while c n zero display style c underscore n right arrow zero. Note that the convergence of c n Display style c underscore n, and therefore also of a n display style underscore n is quadratic. The proof of the method is rather easy. First, rewrite the iterative definition of c n display style c underscore n as 1 plus c n plus 1 equals 1 plus c n 1 minus c n 
2 2 Display style one plus C underscore N plus one equals one plus C underscore N one C underscore N two carrot two. Then it is straightforward to prove by induction that S one plus C N equals A N two display style S one plus C underscore N equals a underscore N carrot two and therefore the convergence of A N display style a underscore N to the desired result S display style S Q R T S is ensured by the convergence of C N display style C underscore N to zero. Which in turn follows from minus one CO two display style minus one. This method was developed around 1950 by M. V. Wilkes, D. J. Wheeler, and S. Gill for use on EDSAC, one of the first electronic computers. The method was later generalized, allowing the computation of non-square roots. Topic. Iterative methods for reciprocal square roots The following are iterative methods for finding the reciprocal square root of S which is 1 S Displaystyle 1, SQRT S Once it has been found, find S Display style S Q R T S by simple multiplication S equals S one S display style S Q R T S equals S C D O T one S Q R T S these iterations involve only multiplication, and not division. They are therefore faster than the Babylonian method. However, they are not stable. If the initial value is not close to the reciprocal square root, the iterations will diverge away from it rather than converge to it. It can therefore be advantageous to perform an iteration of the Babylonian method on a rough estimate before starting to apply these methods. Applying Newton's method to the equation 1 x 2 minus s equals 0 display style 1 x caret 2 s equals 0 produces a method that converges quadratically using three multiplications per step x n plus 1 equals x n 2 3 minus s x n 2 Display style x underscore n plus one equals frac x underscore n two c d o t three s c d o t x underscore n caret two. Another iteration is obtained by Halley's method, which is the Householder's method of order two. This converges cubically, but involves four multiplications per iteration. Y n equals s x n 2 display style y underscore n equals s c d o t x underscore n caret 2 and x n plus 1 equals x n 8 15 minus y n 10 minus 3 y n 
Display style x underscore n plus one equals frac x underscore n eight c d o t fifteen y underscore n c d o t ten to three c d o t y underscore n. Topic Goldschmidt's algorithm. Some computers use Goldschmidt's algorithm to simultaneously calculate s display style sqrt s and 1 s display style 1 sqrt s Goldschmidt's algorithm finds s Display style sqrt s faster than newton raphson iteration on a computer with a fused multiply add instruction and either a pipelined floating point unit or two independent floating point units. The first way of writing Goldschmidt's algorithm begins b zero equals s Display style b underscore zero equals s y zero approximately equals one s display style y underscore zero approximately one s q r t s typically using a table lookup y zero equals y 0 display style y underscore 0 equals y underscore 0 x 0 equals s y 0 display style x underscore 0 equals psi underscore 0 and iterates b n plus 1 equals b n y n 2 display style b underscore n plus 1 equals b underscore n y underscore n caret 2 y n plus 1 equals 3 minus b n plus 1 2 displays Tile y underscore n plus one equals three b underscore n plus one two x n plus one equals x n y n plus one Display style x underscore n plus one equals x underscore n y underscore n plus one y n plus one equals y n y n plus one Display style y underscore n plus one equals y underscore n y underscore n plus one until b i display style b underscore i is sufficiently close to one or a fixed number of iterations. The iterations converge to lim n infinity x n equals s 
Display style lim underscore n to in a t x underscore n equals s q r t s and lim n infinity y n equals one s Display style lim underscore n to n a t y underscore n equals one s q r t s. Note that it is possible to omit either x n display style x underscore n and y n display style y underscore n from the computation, and if both are desired then x n equals s y n display style x underscore n equals psi underscore n may be used at the end rather than computing it through in each iteration. A second form, using fused multiply add operations, begins y 0 approximately equals 1 s displaystyle y underscore 0 approximately 1 s q r t s typically using a table lookup x Zero equals S Y zero display style x underscore zero equals psi underscore zero H zero equals Y zero two Display style h underscore zero equals y underscore zero two and iterates r n equals zero point five minus x n h n Display style r underscore n equals zero five x underscore n h underscore n x n plus one equals x n plus x n r N display style x underscore n plus one equals x underscore n plus x underscore n r underscore n h n plus one equals h n plus h n R N display style H underscore N plus one equals H underscore N plus H underscore N R underscore N until R I display style R underscore I is sufficiently close to zero or a fixed number of iterations. This converges to Lim N infinity X N equals S display style lim underscore N to in a T X underscore N equals S Q R T S and Lim N infinity two H N equals one S 
display style lim underscore n to in a t two h underscore n equals one s q r t s topic Taylor series. If n is an approximation to s display style s q r t s a better approximation can be found by using the taylor series of the square root function n 2 plus d equals n n equals 0 infinity minus 1 n 2 n 1 minus 2 n n 2 4 n d n n 2 n equals n 1 plus d 2 n 2 minus d 2 8 n 4 plus d 3 16 n 6 minus 5 d 4 128 n 8 plus Display style S Q R T N carrot two plus D equals N sum underscore N equals zero carrot in A T F R A C minus one carrot N two N one to two N N carrot two four carrot N F R A C D carrot N N carrot two N equals N one plus F R A C D two N carrot two FRAC D carrot two eight N carrot four plus FRAC D carrot three sixteen N carrot six FRAC five D carrot four one hundred twenty eight N carrot eight plus CDOTS as an iterative method, the order of convergence is equal to the number of terms used. With two terms, it is identical to the Babylonian method. With three terms, each iteration takes almost as many operations as the Bakshali approximation, but converges more slowly. Therefore, this is not a particularly efficient way of calculation. To maximize the rate of convergence, choose n so that d n 2 Display style frac d n caret two is as small as possible. Topic cordic. A completely different method for computing the square root is based on the Cordic algorithm, which uses only very simple operations addition, subtraction, with bit shift and table lookup to implement multiplication. The square root of s may be obtained as the output x n x underscore n using the hyperbolic coordinate system in vectoring mode with the following initialization x 0 equals s plus 1 display style x underscore 0 equals s plus 1 y 
zero equals S minus one Display style y underscore zero equals s one omega zero equals zero display style omega underscore zero equals zero. Topic: Continued fraction expansion. Quadratic irrationals, numbers of the form a plus b c. Display style frac a plus sqrt b c, where a, b, and c are integers, and in particular, square roots of integers have periodic continued fractions. Sometimes what is desired is finding not the numerical value of a square root, but rather its continued fraction expansion, and hence its rational approximation. Let s be the positive number for which we are required to find the square root. Then assuming a to be a number that serves as an initial guess and r to be the remainder term, we can write s equals a Two plus r display style s equals a caret two plus r. Since we have s minus a two equals s plus a s minus a equals r display style s a caret 2 equals s q r t s plus a s q r t s a equals r we can express the square root of s as s equals a plus r a plus s display style s q r t s equals a plus f r a c r a plus s q r t s by applying this expression for s display style s q r t s to the denominator term of the fraction we have s equals a plus r a plus a plus r a plus s equals a plus r 2 plus r a plus s display style s q r t s equals a plus f r a c r a plus a plus f r a c r a plus s q r t s equals a plus f r a c r two a plus f r a c r a plus s q r t s proceeding this way we get a generalized continued fraction for the square root as S equals a plus R two a plus R two a plus R two a plus 
Display style S Q R T S equals A plus F R A C R two A plus F R A C R two A plus F R A C R two A plus C D O T S for any S A possible choice for A and R as a topic one and R S one yielding S equals one plus S minus one two plus S minus one two plus S Minus one two plus Display style S Q R T S equals one plus F R A C S one two plus F R A C S one two plus F R A C S one two plus C D O T S For example, for the square root of two, we can take a Topic one and R one giving us two equals one plus one two plus one two plus one two Plus Display style SQRT two equals one plus FRAC one two plus FRAC one two plus FRAC one two plus CDOTS Taking the first three denominators give the rational approximation of square root two as one two 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 Topic seventeen twelfths one point four one six six seven correct up to first three decimal places. Taking the first five denominators gives the rational approximation to square root two as one two 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 two. Topic Ninety nine seventieths one point four one four two eight five seven correct up to first five decimal places. Taking more denominators give better approximations. As another example, for the square root of three, we can select a topic. Two and R minus one giving us three equals two minus one four minus one four minus one four Minus Display style SQRT three equals two FRAC one four FRAC one four FRAC one four CDOTS The first three denominators gives square root three as one point seven three two one four, correct up to the first four decimal places. Note that it is not necessary to choose an integer valued a. For instance, we can take a topic square root two and r one such that three equals two plus 
1 2 2 plus 1 2 2 plus 1 2 2 plus Display style SQRT three equals SQRT two plus FRAC one two SQRT two plus FRAC one two SQRT two plus FRAC one two SQRT two plus CDOTS. We can do the same for the whole numbers as well. For instance, two equals four equals one plus three two plus three two plus three two plus Display style two equals SQRT four equals one plus FRAC three two plus FRAC three two plus FRAC three two plus CDOTS Topic Algorithm The following iterative algorithm can be used to obtain the continued fraction expansion in canonical form S is any natural number that is not a perfect square M 0 equals 0 Display style M underscore 0 equals 0 D 0 equals one display style d underscore zero equals one a zero equals s display style a underscore zero equals left l floor s q r t s right r floor m n plus one equals D N A N minus M N display style M underscore N plus one equals D underscore N A underscore N M underscore N D N plus one equals s minus m n plus 1 2 d n Display style D underscore N plus one equals FRAC SM underscore N plus one carrot two D underscore N A N plus one equals S plus M N plus one D N plus one equals a zero plus M N plus one D N plus one 
Display style a underscore n plus one equals left L floor FRAC SQRT S plus M underscore N plus one D underscore N plus one right R floor equals left L floor FRAC a underscore zero plus M underscore N plus one D underscore N plus one right R floor Notice that Minnesota, dn, and an are always integers. The algorithm terminates when this triplet is the same as one encountered before. The algorithm can also terminate on i when i equals 2a0, which is easier to implement. The expansion will repeat from then on. The sequence a0, a1, a2, a3 is the continued fraction expansion. S equals a 0 plus 1 a 1 plus 1 a 2 plus 1 a 3 plus Display style SQRT S equals a underscore zero plus CFRAC one a underscore one plus CFRAC one a underscore two plus CFRAC one a underscore three plus D dots. Topic Example, square root of 114 as a continued fraction. Begin with m0. Topic, 0, d0. One, and a0. Topic. Ten one hundred two one hundred and one hundred twelve equals one hundred twenty one greater than one hundred fourteen so ten chosen one hundred fourteen equals one hundred fourteen plus zero one equals Ten plus one hundred fourteen minus ten one equals ten plus one hundred fourteen minus ten one hundred fourteen plus ten one hundred fourteen plus ten equals ten plus one hundred fourteen minus one hundred. 114 plus 10 equals 10 plus 1114 plus 1014. Display style begin aligned sqrt 114 and equals frac sqrt 114 plus 0 1 equals 10 plus frac sqrt 114 minus 10 1 equals 10 plus frac SQRT one hundred fourteen minus ten SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O and equals ten plus FRAC one hundred fourteen to one hundred SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O equals ten plus FRAC one FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen 
14 plus 1 O 14 end aligned M1 equals D0 as 0 minus M0 equals 1 10 minus 0 equals 10 display style M underscore 1 equals D underscore 0 C D O T A underscore 0 M underscore 0 equals 1 C D O T 10 minus 0 equals 10 D one equals S minus M one two D zero equals one hundred fourteen minus ten two one equals fourteen Display style D underscore one equals FRAC SM underscore one carrot two D underscore zero equals FRAC one hundred fourteen to ten carrot two one equals fourteen A one equals A zero plus M one D one equals ten plus ten fourteen equals twenty fourteen equals one Display style a underscore one equals left L floor FRAC a underscore zero plus M underscore one D underscore one right R floor equals left L floor FRAC ten plus ten fourteen right R floor equals left L floor FRAC twenty fourteen right R floor equals one so M one Topic ten D one fourteen and A one equals one one hundred fourteen plus ten fourteen equals one plus one hundred fourteen minus four fourteen equals one plus one hundred fourteen minus sixteen fourteen one hundred fourteen plus four equals 1 plus 1 114 plus 4 7 Display style FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O fourteen equals one plus FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen minus four fourteen equals one plus FRAC one hundred fourteen to sixteen fourteen SQRT one hundred fourteen plus four equals one plus FRAC one FRAC C SQRT one hundred fourteen plus four seven. Next M two Topic four D two seven and A two equals two one hundred fourteen plus four Seven equals two plus one hundred fourteen minus ten seven equals two 
plus fourteen seven one hundred fourteen plus ten equals two plus one one hundred fourteen plus ten two Display style FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen plus four seven equals two plus FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen minus ten seven equals two plus FRAC fourteen seven SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O equals two plus FRAC one FRAC SQRT one 114 plus 102 114 plus 10 2 equals 10 plus 114 minus 10 2 equals 10 plus 14 2 114 plus 10 equals 10 plus 1 114 plus 10 7 Display style FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O two equals ten plus FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen minus ten two equals ten plus FRAC fourteen two SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O equals ten plus FRAC one FRAC SQRT one hundred one hundred fourteen plus one oh seven one hundred fourteen plus ten seven equals two plus one hundred fourteen minus four seven equals two plus 98 7 114 plus 4 equals 2 plus 1 114 plus 4 14 Display style FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O seven equals two plus FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen minus four seven equals two plus FRAC ninety eight seven SQRT one hundred fourteen plus four equals two plus FRAC one FRAC SQRT 114 plus 4 14 114 plus 4 14 equals 1 plus 114 minus 10 14 equals 1 plus 14 14 114 plus 10 equals 1 plus 1 114 plus 10 1 
Display style FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen plus four fourteen equals one plus FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen minus ten fourteen equals one plus FRAC fourteen fourteen SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O equals one plus FRAC one FRAC SQRT T one hundred fourteen plus one O one one hundred fourteen plus ten one equals twenty plus one hundred fourteen minus ten one equals Twenty plus fourteen one hundred fourteen plus ten equals twenty plus one one hundred fourteen plus ten fourteen Display style FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O one equals twenty plus FRAC SQRT one hundred fourteen minus ten one equals twenty plus FRAC fourteen SQRT one hundred fourteen plus one O equals twenty plus FRAC one FRAC SQRT one hundred Hundred fourteen plus one o fourteen. Now loop back to the second equation above. Consequently, the simple continued fraction for the square root of one hundred fourteen is one hundred fourteen equals ten one two ten two one. Twenty one two ten two one twenty one two ten two one twenty Display style SQRT one hundred fourteen equals ten one two ten two one twenty one two ten two one twenty one two ten two one twenty dots sequence A O one O one seven nine in the OEIS its decimal value is approximately ten point six seven seven zero seven eight two five two O three one three one one two one Topic Generalized continued fraction A more rapid method is to evaluate its generalized continued fraction. From the formula derived there, z equals x two plus y equals x plus y two x plus y 2 x plus y 2 x plus equals x plus 2 x y 2 Two Z minus Y minus Y minus Y two 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 
z minus y minus y 2 2 2 z minus y minus Display style sqrt z equals sqrt x caret two plus y equals x plus cfrac y two x plus cfrac y two x plus cfrac y two x plus d dots equals x plus cfrac two x c d o t y two two z y y C F R A C Y carrot two 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 Z Y C F R A C Y carrot two 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 Z Y D dots and the fact that 114 is two thirds of the way between 102 equals 100 and 112 equals 121 results in 114 equals Ten twenty six three equals thirty two two plus two three equals thirty two three plus two three sixty four plus Two sixty four plus two sixty four plus two sixty four plus equals thirty two three plus two one hundred ninety two plus eighteen one hundred ninety two plus eighteen one hundred ninety two plus Display style SQRT one hundred fourteen equals CFRAC SQRT ten twenty six three equals CFRAC SQRT thirty two carat two plus two three equals CFRAC thirty two three plus CFRAC two thirds sixty four plus CFRAC two sixty four plus Plus CFRAC two sixty four plus CFRAC two sixty four plus D dots equals CFRAC thirty two three plus CFRAC two one hundred ninety two plus CFRAC eighteen one hundred ninety two plus CFRAC eighteen one hundred ninety two plus D dots which is simply the aforementioned 10, 1, 2, 10, 2, 1, 20, 1, 2, 10, 2, 1, 20, 1, 2. Evaluated at every third term. Combining pairs of fractions produces 114 equals 32 2 plus Two three equals thirty two three plus sixty four three twenty fifty minus one minus one twenty fifty minus one twenty fifty minus equals thirty two three plus sixty four six thousand one hundred fifty minus 
3 minus 9 6150 minus 9 6150 minus Display style SQRT one hundred fourteen equals CFRAC SQRT thirty two carat two plus two three equals CFRAC thirty two three plus CFRAC sixty four thirds twenty fifty two one CFRAC one twenty fifty CFRAC one twenty fifty D dots equals C CFRAC thirty two three plus CFRAC sixty four six thousand one hundred fifty minus three CFRAC nine six thousand one hundred fifty CFRAC nine six thousand one hundred fifty D dots which is now ten one two ten two one twenty one two ten two one twenty one two evaluated at the third term and every six terms thereafter. Topic Using Pell's equation. Pell's equation, also known as Brahmagupta equation, since he was the first to give a solution to this particular equation, and its variants yield a method for efficiently finding continued fraction convergence of square roots of integers. However, it can be complicated to execute, and usually not every convergent is generated. The ideas behind the method are as follows. If p q is a solution where p and q are integers to the equation p two equals s q two plus or minus one display style p caret two equals s c d o t q caret two p m one then p q display style frac p q is a continued fraction convergent of s display style s q r t s and as such is an excellent rational approximation to it if pa q a and p b q b are solutions, then so as p equals p a p b plus s q a q b Display style p equals p underscore a p underscore b plus s c d o t q underscore a q underscore b q equals p a q b plus p b q a display style q equals p underscore a q underscore b plus p underscore b q underscore a. Compare to the multiplication of quadratic integers. More generally, if p one q one is a solution, then it is possible to generate a sequence of solutions p n q n satisfying p m plus n equals p m p n plus s q m q n 
Display style p underscore m plus n equals p underscore m p underscore n plus s c d o t q underscore m q underscore n q m plus n equals p m q n plus p n q m display style q underscore m plus n equals p underscore m q underscore n plus p underscore n q underscore m the method is as follows find positive integers p1 and q1 such that p one two equals S Q one two plus or minus one Display style P underscore one carrot two equals S C D O T Q underscore one carrot two PM one this is the hard part, it can be done either by guessing, or by using fairly sophisticated techniques. To generate a long list of convergence, iterate P N plus 1 equals P 1 P N plus S Q one Q N Display style P underscore N plus one equals P underscore one P underscore N plus S C D O T Q underscore one Q underscore N Q N plus one equals P one Q N plus P N Q one Display style Q underscore N plus one equals P underscore one Q underscore N plus P underscore N Q underscore one to find the larger convergence quickly, iterate P two N equals P N two plus S Q N two Display style p underscore two n equals p underscore n carrot two plus s c d o t q underscore n carrot two q two n equals two p n q n display style q underscore two n equals two p underscore n q underscore n. Notice that the corresponding sequence of fractions coincides with the one given by the Hero's method, starting with p one q one display style text style frac p underscore one q underscore one. In either case. P N Q N display style frac p underscore n q underscore n is a rational approximation satisfying p n q n minus s one q n two s display style left frac p underscore n q underscore n s q r t s right. Topic. Approximations that depend on the floating point representation A number is represented in a floating point format as M times B P 
display style m times b caret p which is also called scientific notation its square root as m times b p 2 display style sqrt m times b caret p 2 and similar formulae would apply for cube roots and logarithms on the face of it this is no improvement in simplicity but suppose that only an approximation is required then just b p 2 display style b caret p 2 is good to an order of magnitude. Next, recognize that some powers, p, will be odd, thus for 3141.59 equals 3.14159 times 103 rather than deal with fractional powers of the base, multiply the mantissa by the base and subtract 1 from the power to make it even. The adjusted representation will become the equivalent of 31.4159 times 102 so that the square root will be square root 31.4159 times 10. If the integer part of the adjusted mantissa is taken, there can only be the values 1 to 99, and that could be used as an index into a table of 99 pre-computed square roots to complete the estimate. A computer using base 16 would require a larger table, but one using base 2 would require only three entries. The possible bits of the integer part of the adjusted mantissa are 01, the power being even so there was no shift, remembering that a normalized floating point number always has a non zero high order digit, or if the power was odd, 10 or 11, these being the first two bits of the original mantissa. Thus, six twenty five. Topic one hundred ten point zero one in binary, normalized to one point one zero zero one times twenty two and even power, so the paired bits of the mantissa are O one, while point six two five. 0.101 in binary normalizes to 1.01 times 2 minus 1 an odd power so the adjustment is to 10.1 times 2 minus 2 and the paired bits are 10. Notice that the low order bit of the power is echoed in the high order bit of the pairwise mantissa. An even power has its low order bit 0 and the adjusted mantissa will start with 0, whereas for an odd power that bit is 1 and the adjusted mantissa will start with 1. Thus, when the power is halved, it is as if its low order bit is shifted out to become the first bit of the pairwise mantissa. A table with only three entries could be enlarged by incorporating additional bits of the mantissa. However, with computers, rather than calculate an interpolation into a table, it is often better to find some simpler calculation giving equivalent results. Everything now depends on the exact details of the format of the representation, plus what operations are available to access and manipulate the parts of the number. For example, Fortran offers an exponent x function to obtain the power. Effort expended in devising a good initial approximation is to be recouped by thereby avoiding the additional iterations of the refinement process that would have been needed for a poor approximation. Since these are few, one iteration requires a divide, an add, and a halving, the constraint is severe. Many computers follow the IEEE or sufficiently similar representation, and a very rapid approximation to the square root can be obtained for starting Newton's method. The technique that follows is based on the fact that the floating point format in base 2 approximates the base 2 logarithm. That is log 2 m times 2 p equals p 
p plus log 2 m display style log underscore 2 m times 2 caret p equals p plus log underscore 2 m so for a 32-bit single precision floating point number in IEEE format where notably, the power has a bias of 127 added for the represented form, you can get the approximate logarithm by interpreting its binary representation as a 32-bit integer, scaling it by 2 minus 23 Display style two carat minus twenty three, and removing a bias of one hundred twenty seven, i.e. x int two minus twenty three minus one hundred twenty seven, approximately equals log two. X display style x underscore text int c d o t two caret minus twenty three minus one hundred twenty seven approximately log underscore two x. For example, one point zero is represented by a hexadecimal number hexadecimal three f eight o o o o o, which would represent. 1,065,353,216 equals 127 2 23 display style 1,065,353,216 equals 127 cdot 2 caret 23 if taken as an integer. Using the formula above you get 1,065,353,216 2 minus 23 minus 127 equals 0 Display style one billion sixty five million three hundred fifty three thousand two hundred sixteen C D O T two carat minus twenty three minus one hundred twenty seven equals zero as expected from log two one point O Display style log underscore two one point O in a similar fashion you get 0.5 from 1.5 hexadecimal 3 fc 0000 to get the square root divide the logarithm by 2 and convert the value back the following program demonstrates the idea note that the exponent's lowest bit is intentionally allowed to propagate into the mantissa one way to justify the steps in this program is to assume B display style B is the exponent bias and n display style n is the number of explicitly stored bits in the mantissa and then show that x int 2 n minus B 2 plus b 2 n equals x int minus 2 n 2 plus b plus 1 2 2 n 
Display style x underscore text int two carrot n b two plus b c d o t two carrot n equals x underscore text int minus two carrot n two plus b plus one two c d o t two carrot n the three mathematical operations forming the core of the above function can be expressed in a single line. An additional adjustment can be added to reduce the maximum relative error. So, the three operations, not including the cast, can be rewritten as where A is a bias for adjusting the approximation errors. For example, with a Topic zero. The results are accurate for even powers of two, e.g., 1.0. But for other numbers, the results will be slightly too big, e.g., 1.5 for 2.0 instead of 1.414, with 6% error. With a Hexadecimal 4 BOD2, the maximum relative error is minimized to plus or minus 3.5%. If the approximation is to be used for an initial guess for Newton's method to the equation 1 x 2 minus s equals 0 Display style one x caret two s equals zero. Then the reciprocal form shown in the following section is preferred. Topic: Reciprocal of the square root. A variant of the above routine is included below, which can be used to compute the reciprocal of the square root, i.e. x minus 1 2 display style x caret 1 over 2 instead was written by Greg Walsh. The integer shift approximation produced a relative error of less than 4%, and the error dropped further to 0.15% with one iteration of Newton's method on the following line. In computer graphics it is a very efficient way to normalize a vector. Some VLSI hardware implements inverse square root using a second-degree polynomial estimation followed by a Goldschmidt iteration. Topic negative or complex square if s s equals s i display style s q r t s equals s q r t vert s vert i if s equals a plus by where a and b are real and b does not equal zero then its principal square root is s equals s plus a two plus s g n b s minus a two i display style s q r t s equals sqrt frac vert s vert plus a 2 plus operator name sgn b sqrt frac vert s vert a 2 i this can be verified by squaring the root here s equals a 2 plus b 2 display style vert s vert equals sqrt a caret 2 plus b caret 2 is the modulus of s the principal square root of a complex number is defined to be the root with the non negative real part topic see also Alpha max plus beta min algorithm Integer square root Mental calculation Nth root algorithm Recurrence relation Shifting nth root algorithm Square root of 2 Topic. Notes
Topic: External links. Weistein, Eric W. Square root algorithms. MathWorld. Square roots by subtraction. Integer square root algorithm by Andrea Radovich. Personal calculator algorithms I. Square roots. William E. Egbert, Hewlett Packard Journal, May 1977, page 22. Calculator to learn the square root.